coach, another resilient performance, but um, just probably just a little bit out past that fair? No, uh, I don't think we helped ourselves. Um, yeah, we, we were resilient, definitely. Just had a chat there. I, I thought our defence was uh, was very stoic, and we, we dug our heels in. And it, it's something we'll always get out of this group. Uh, they'll never give up, and uh, I, I think that showed tonight. Defensively, uh, excellent. Just uh, we, we obviously a couple of early long-range tries uh, in the first ten minutes, and then uh, unfortunately on the other side of the ball with the attack side, I think we just couldn't get any continuity. Dropped too much ball. Um, so yeah. It was a bit of a struggle there. You played with the Brummie and Brent's tarp man out of the most compared. Would you say, Jeremy? Yeah, I, I guess um, you know that we talked about them for a little bit at the start of the week of being, you know, they've been one of the top teams in Aussie for a, a long time now, so it would be a good measure of uh, where we're sitting. I just, I, yeah, same as Sam, but I just don't think we are. Uh, Put ourselves in the right spot in the first 15, 20 minutes there. Um, after that, I thought we had um, as much position as they did and put them under a lot of pressure. We just couldn't execute and get over the line. Um, and so I guess a couple of times maybe we should have kicked for the for the sticks and tried to build a bit of, build a bit of pressure that way. But um, you know, I guess um, that's what it is. You, you take your foot off the accelerator for 10, 15 minutes in Super Rugby, and you know you can be 15. 20 points down, and you have to dig yourself out of a hole, which unfortunately we were in in that first first half. Yeah. Zero and three, how do you uh, how do you find that win? What's the difference that's going to be the game changer? Oh, look, I, I think we just got to front up every week. Yeah, the wins will come. Uh, we we're very close, and obviously in those first two rounds, and um, you know, although we didn't get the wins, we, we we feel like they're not far around the corner. Um, probably a little bit of a setback tonight, but we. You know, we roll in on Monday and prepare well for a hit out against the Rebels next week. What's, uh, what's missing to get that first big trade? Uh... Oh, I think Jerry just touched on it there. It's you know, little lapses. Uh, yeah, you've, you've got to take opportunities when they present. and um, you know, it's, a, you know, it's a learning experience for, for some guys. and you know, we, we talk about it, we're aware of it. So it's, it's just adding some polish to, to some parts of our game and making sure when uh, we do have opportunities, we do have momentum to continue that. And you know, I'm sure the win, or well, I know the win, will be just around the corner. Jeremy, you, the body took a battery tonight. <laughs> yeah, yeah, uh, you feel it. For the next couple of days, uh, I guess it's uh, the, the older you get, it takes a little bit longer to recover. But um, I enjoy it. Yeah, yeah, it's you know it's good to feel sore <laughs> two or three days later. So uh, I guess it feels like you put in a bit of a work. Um, but yeah, yeah it, was, it was a pretty physical game. Um, I guess the conditions kind of made it that way a little bit. A uh, bit of a slippery ball, so it was a uh, fair bit of forward uh, play in that. But yeah, it was good. How disappointing is it to? You're coming back to the fray, but you have to play away from your, your fans. How difficult is that, or how frustrating is that? Yeah, I think it's pretty frustrating. We've got, um, from, from when I got there, um, the two years ago, just the, the amount of loyal supporters we have over there that um, would turn up to every game of uh, the Global Rapid Rugby and, and, and the awesome support we had, and then even just all the messages that we're getting while we're over here, um, you know, it, it, it drives us. It drives us to try to succeed and and be better every week. And you know, we we definitely um, we notice you notice know, notice that support, and it, and and uh, we're very grateful for it. It'd be great to be able to get back over to Perth and, and be able to put um, a few super super rugby games on on that field is over it, there. Is that not a plan to get back to uh, to Perth and play some games? We'd we'd love to be back in Perth and yeah. playing some games, definitely.